punk, sitting, drinking through a straw like it owns the place. Psst. Acting like it's all normal and stuff. It's really starting to grate on my nerves. Shh! We're on a surveillance mission! Yeah, sorry, it's just you. Don't sneak up on me like that. Jeez. You see that bunny thing? There's a god-eater in there. I know that for sure. I can't believe someone can fight in that. Whoever it is, they're pretty damn good. But no one has ever seen who's inside. And that's not even the weirdest bit. No unit, no service history. It's an enigma wrapped in a mystery, wrapped in a costume. Habari knows everyone, so I asked her to do some research. The next day, she came back white as a sheet. She begged us not to dig any deeper. Yeah, it could get pretty dangerous, but Arena and I are willing to take that risk. We're determined to find the truth. We just gotta find out who that thing is. What? Damn, slipped away again. Captain, I'm scared. It's like there's a dark storm brewing on the horizon. Um, by the by. We're buddies, right? Buddies that maybe wouldn't mention this to the higher-ups? Awesome. I trust you. All right, then. We need a new strategy here. I suggest we split up and do some digging. Find out who's behind the mask. First, though, let's take the hair on a mission and keep watch. If we're lucky, the facade may just slip. You'd better not turn tail out there, Captain. Same to you, Arena. Don't let the creepy bunny suit get you all scared. Stupid rabbit! Even on a crazy mission like that, its stupid rabbit costume didn't slip up once. Stupid. Not to mention, that rabbit totally showed us up. Yeah. Yeah! Good plan! I like the way Blood thinks. <laughs> Actually, do you think maybe we're a little too desperate to get to the bottom of this? We should have started with something basic. We don't even know if it's male or female. You might be onto something there, Arena. All right, let's change the parameters of the operation. Step one is to gather evidence. There must be something to indicate its gender. Excellent. You distract it, and I'll go for the pants. What? How can you even suggest that? You'll never get his or her pants off. Wait, that's it! <laughs> I've had a stroke of genius. The bathroom. Yes, that's brilliant. We'll follow it to the bathroom. Huh? Ah! I, um... Oh, we didn't mean... We... We weren't gonna spy on anyone in the bathroom. <laughs> That's crazy. Is it... reporting to someone? Did... did that just happen? Look! It left the magazine! This is it! This is the evidence we need to figure out if it's a boy or a girl! Stay back, team! It could be a trap. Though, it doesn't really seem like one. All right. Let's do this. What the...? Cuddly cats and canines quarterly. Gotcha now, bunny suit! Got a whole lot of nothing. Seriously? Cats and canines? I can't even tell if that punk's a cat person or a dog person. Arr, we're back to square one. So I went to the archives, did a little digging on how to run a proper investigation. All the old cop shows said you gotta put in legwork. You gotta make inquiries, gotta be patient, gotta wear cool hats. I thought of another lead we could follow. 
Where's the bunny's room? It's gotta sleep. If we find out where, maybe we get our answer. So, here's what we're gonna do. Let's gather some witnesses and put together some testimony. That'll put us on this bunny's tail. You sound just like a real gumshoe, Captain. All in a day's work, Detective Arena. All right, you bring it on a mission. Do your thing. Just keep it away for a while. While you've got it distracted, Arena and I will pound the pavement and scare up some witnesses. Good plan, sir. This is gonna work for sure. Thanks to your help, we managed to gather a ton of rock-solid witness statements. Be ready. Some of what you're about to hear may just blow your mind. Arena, call in the first witness. Would the first witness step forward and state your name? Hello, everyone. My name is Mutsumi Chikura. Excellent. Miss Chikura, would you please tell those assembled what you saw on the night in question? Sure. Last night, I saw Kigurumi waiting in the lobby. Of course, the lobby. And how did he or she appear at the time? In costume, Captain Koda, sir. Interesting. Very interesting indeed. Following this encounter, where did he or she go? Into the main elevator. I think it stopped at the lab floor. You said that you saw Kigurumi last evening. Mr. Von Strasbourg? Indeed, my good man. I saw the creature heading towards Aegis last eve. However, I already know the truth. It is no mere rabbit, but a ninja in rabbit's garb. Have you forgotten our location? Where else would one see a member of the ancient clans? A silent assassin, clad in shadows and cunning disguise. A defender of truth and justice. I'm not sure you know what ninja are. I'll say nothing. You don't know anything about Kigurumi? I'll say nothing. I cannot answer your question. But surely, as an operator... Information gained in the line of duty may not be divulged. I do not make the rules. Uh, sorry, Fran. Though they say nothing about... rumors. Kigurumi was mistaken for trash while sleeping on the lobby floor last night. Uh, allegedly. Ah, I see. Thank you, allegedly. Arena, if you'd summarize what we've learned here today. Of course. According to testimony, Kigurumi was in three places at once last night. It was spotted in an elevator to the labs, on its way to Aegis, and sleeping in the lobby. Hmm. It seems like three separate, completely independent instances. But there must be a unifying attribute. How far down does this dastardly case lead? Wait! That can only mean one thing. Or rather, three things. With these facts in hand, I believe we are dealing with three unique suspects. But how can that be, Captain? Damn, we're right back where we started. The Kigurumi are so clever! Uh, let's leave it here for the day. Man! All that planning, all that investigation, and what have we got to show for it? There's really nothing else to do. You dare surrender? Proud knights of the Far East Branch's first unit. You would flee at a time like this? Oh man, not this again. Leave us alone, Emil. You don't know how much work we've done. Hmm, Struth, I know not of what you've done. But do you know why I know not? I'll tell you. Because I am not sure what you're talking about. Fine. 
Sit down and I'll explain. I see. That does indeed sound most vexing. But you're hooked, right? Don't you just need to know who Kigurumi is? Why trouble yourselves with stealth? Simply approach the rabbit and ask! In fact, leave this to me! Of you. Oh, I, I, I must say, I have borne witness to your skills. They are chivalrous to the core. Kigurumi, if I may be so bold as to ask. You've said nary a word, yet thy strength of arms is a testament to the night within thee. To walk that lonely road. Should we not reveal our true selves and speak freely, Sarah? I doubt not the veracity of your purpose, imprisoning truth within such beastly guise. Now, open thy heart, Kigurumi. I profess I can see the warmth behind those icy prison walls. Be not afraid. I knew that glance, the stroke of fear beneath that bunny gaze. You fear to expose your weak self to a man as renowned and honored as I. Why keep you your silence? What fury has stilled thy tongue? Why art thou... Art thou... Art thou, Kigurumi, merely a stuffed toy? I'll not surrender. I'll not give in. I will knock upon thy heart till it opens unto me. Trust in me, Kigurumi. I beseech you, answer me! No! Forgive me, my brother! Are you telling me this thing was empty all along? This is really creeping me out! How far down does this rabbit hole go? At least, at least we've got one question answered. I'm not done with you yet, Kigurumi. So that's everything we know so far, as you can see. What we can see is that you know nothing at all, do you, Koda? Um, okay, yeah, gotta give you that one. Ahem. <clears throat> Point is, there's only one thing left to try. Brute force. Join us in this. We've struggled so long to learn the truth, and we are so close! Join us! Sure! I've come this far. I suppose there's no turning back. We won't let her get away. This time, my words will reach his heart. Thank you, my comrades. This new mission is officially a go. Let us begin 
Operation Bunny Strike. We'll keep the same basic formula. It's up to you to take Flopsy on a mission. We'll prepare everything for your return. Fran here with a mission update. The target and decoy are en route to the dead. Operation Bunny Strike is a go. Estimated time of arrival, one minute. Thanks, Fran. Keep us in the loop. Mutsumi, your task is to lure the target into the kill zone. Keep calm. I believe in you. Just keep up your disarming cuteness. Once the target is distracted, Arena, you're up. Go for the legs and take it down. Hard. Emil, don't do anything. Once Arena has the target restrained, I'll move in and unveil it. Squad, this is the moment of truth. Target has entered the room. Ah, Higurumi, Captain, welcome back. Come have a drink. Target in motion. Four seconds to kill zone. Three. Two. Contact. Okay, good, good work, everyone. Mission successful. D dismissed.